Hearts thumping, tension building here in the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Lee Dixon, and we've got Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It is Juventus facing Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that if you win your home games and don't lose your away games, you've got a good chance of progressing. of Italian football going with this starting 11. And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. A few years ago, there were many who wondered if Dortmund would still be around, but they certainly bounced back and, of course, got to the Champions League final in 2013. They are a fabulous football club, Lee. Well, they are. One word springs to mind for me. Charisma. Re Nothing wrong with that idea. Pulisic. And a Dortmund corner here. Marco Royce with a corner. Corner right on the back of the last one. Royce taking this one. And they'll have to throw it back in play. Douglas Costa has lost it. Peace check with it. Mario Götze at the ready. Well, the cross was acceptable, but no one there to thump at home. It's with Joao Cancelo. Pjanic. Cristiano Ronaldo. Matuidi. And now Ronaldo. Ronaldo! with Marco Royce. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. Here's Piszczek. Well, let's see, does he mean business? Mario Götze at the ready. Keeper did his job to begin with. And this is Weigel. Splendid block from Chiellini. It's with Dybala. Cristiano Ronaldo. Pjanic. Juventus have given it away. The tackle crisp and accurate. Whatever it takes to keep them out. And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. ball comes from he's not got an awful lot of time or space but he gets the power from somewhere and it's a brilliant finish and underway once more it is advantage Juventus Julian Weigel now Philip possession seeded by Dortmund Tremendous intuition to win it back. Paolo Dybala can be a handful. And the defender finding a solution to the problem. 
It's with Dybala. Now Kadira. Excellent challenge. Well, regaining possession for his side. Cleverly. Janic. Dybala. And here's Kadira. An opportunity to add to their advantage, but not taken. It was worth an effort, wasn't it? Too much space was given to him. Takes the shot on. Beautifully timed. And showing fine vision. Well, just couldn't quite keep himself onside. The flag has gone up. Now, Matuidi. The Bianconeri tend to be loved or hated by Italian fans, depending on their point of view. What's your take, Lee? Well, I must have told you this before. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And that will mean a caution. Well, definitely yellow card, Derek. for that move but they couldn't make it count and on the basis of that effort quite clearly he's not wearing his shooting boots at the moment well it was a strong effort used his laces but uh, screwed it well off target the referee's verdict is three additional minutes Matuidi Marco Reis Mario Götze it's with Weigel Still be able to do a bit of damage. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. And so the second half has started. Borussia Dortmund in need of a lift. has let the advantage accrue to Juventus Costa with it Manuel Akanji here's Ronaldo Marco Reis and good sir Janic puts his body on the line Coming up for Dortmund. Corner kick played in. Well up behind for another corner. And Dortmund will go to the bench. Corner kick played over. Well, he couldn't quite keep the header down. Well, it was the pace on the cross. Sometimes with that much power on the cross, just cushion it, otherwise it goes over. It's with Joao Cancelo. Kadira. Juventus, the old lady. They know how to keep them. And here is Dybala. Kadira might fancy it. Not messing around with that clearance. Well, that's Costa. Alexandro now. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. A case of foiling the opposition by whatever means. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. Pulisic now. And it's Maximilian Philip. Pulisic. And Philip. Over the touchline for a throw-in. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Straightforward take. And given away by Dortmund. Job done, ball one. 
Toprak. The ball with Marco Reus. Promising attack this from Borussia Dortmund. What can they do from here? Options are plenty. Kadira. It's with Guerrero. And that is offside. And a substitution in the offing. Attempting to play catch up in this second half. Lee, what ought the priorities to be? Well, Dortmund have scored late, late goals in the past. We know that. They surely won't give up. They're desperate for one now. They'll pile the pressure on, push the opposition backwards. Surely they will get one more chance. Emery Can now. Well, that's Costa. And now Ronaldo. And now Douglas Costa. Whatever it takes to keep them out. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Here's Ronaldo. Ronaldo cutting inside here. Marco Reus. Julian Weigel. Five minutes remaining. And one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. And an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Pulisic. Now Philip. And it's Maximilian Philip. Oh, he's missed it. Oh, a goal behind Derek, and he's missed. It's a big miss. Douglas Costa. Juventus have given it away. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. This game is in the history books. 